Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. Well, this is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, on the face of it, Peter, we would appear to have a high-caliber meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in. And this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction and hopefully the style of contest. So it's away we go then. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Well, I'm going to say the Uruguayan Cavani. His willingness to put so much effort in is why he scores so many goals. And that also translates to his defensive work in pressing, chasing and tackling. It's all there from him. Yes, he's certainly the one who carries the hopes of his team. And it's all Brighton. Pogba battles to win it back. No, that's not the ball he wanted. What an adventurous run from a defender. Perez. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Van der Beek. Rashford provides an outlet. And a header! He's got away with one there. Oh, that was great pressure to force the initial error, Peter. It's the perfect example as to why this is a favourite tactic of a lot of teams these days. All Brighton. Johnny Evans and it's played forward McTominay Rashford pings it out wide and they've got it back as soon as it's Rashford Wolves loose who's getting there McTominay plays it out to the wing Didi. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well, not really. To be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. That will be a goal kick. Johnny Evans hoists it forward Pogba tries to get it forward quickly Bruno Fernandes Perez finds himself eased off the ball Alex Tellez, and the finish! Oh, that was no routine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp.
Vardy is on to it and can take it up. Going through. Gets wrestled off the ball. McTominay demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Madison. Cavani. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Perez. Perez has got himself a free kick. And it's all Brighton. It's come loose. Chance! Oh, just why? That's just plain unlucky. There were many, me included, who thought that was going in. Pogba drives it forward. Rashford finds himself offside. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. There really wasn't very much in that. Not far away from being a telling final ball. Leicester seemed to have chosen a tougher route through the middle. That was easily read and dealt with. Juan Bissaka. Didi Perez Johnny Evans Perez Didi and here's Rashford Cavani and here's Rashford has got rid of that and that'll be the final action of the first half so both sides have drawn blanks and have toiled at times but it's not been a bad game by any means interesting half just missing goals so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break nil nil so we're just settling back into this second half what first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped lots of effort but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone could step up and produce something a little more magical Perez Ndidi and it's Cavani Madison good challenge he just stood firm Rashford Cavani just brushed off the ball there and here's Cavani he is not one readily to admit defeat don't be surprised if he tries that again he's got away Bruno Fernandes now it's Cavani he's tried one no, he's missed it. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot. And it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. Fuchs. Well, into the second half, and it's still goalless.
Perez. Van der Beek. Umtiti needed to come up with a better ball. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. There's a long ball. Gets it back. Madison. Oh, that's nice. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Kasper Schmeichel deals with it effortlessly. Perez. And here's Vardy. McTominay gets it back. Vardy really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Didi. And here's Vardy. It is still anyone's game. Nil-nil. Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. That's a real shame, Peter, because it was beautifully worked. Took the defence out of the picture, but he'll be in no hurry to watch the replay. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Tielemans. Vardy has a hit! It's a carbon copy of the previous miss. They're just lacking a cutting edge, Peter. And while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually quite good. Time for a change in personnel. Cavani is leading the charge, but he's having to go it alone. Perez. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. goes looking Manchester United showing a good level of intensity at this stage they're calling on all their resources now well that's a foul free kicks been given This can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Fuchs tries to switch the play. Perez. Nicely controlled. Perez powering header. Well, I just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Fuchs battles to win it back. Didi Tielemans Fuchs Madison Some good play on the left hand side now to profit from it Forward it goes Now it's Cavani How many intercept And that's it Well it looked nil-nil from a fair way out little craft or guile or penetration 